listen, I'm a big fan of Nori. Nori, CNN, the whole Queens movement. I was a fan of Nori before Kanye West was even a thought. I watched that episode of Drink Champs and I thought it was a little eerie, to say the least. I thought at a point it seemed like I was starting to watch somebody unravel with narcissistic behavior. And I, I mean about Kanye West. I understand Nori has a job to do and he is a journalist, whether he thinks he is or not. And he does work for a network, Revolt. My biggest issue is, even if he decided to address it at the two hour and 30 minute mark, a situation and a comment made like the one he made about George Floyd saying that it was a fentanyl and it wasn't Derek Chauvin's knee pressed down on that man's neck, you know what I'm saying, cutting his oxygen, his, you know what I'm saying, his pipeline to, to breathing. To me, it was deplorable. Not only was it deplorable, imagine if you're the family and you sit back and you, and you, you see this or someone sends you a clip of this interview, which is all over the internet now when you hear this comment, what would you think? And I think about my own children Listen, I understand people have to do what they got to do for ratings, and that's fine. But I truly believe that he should have checked Kanye at that moment that he even opened his mouth and said, Fenton, he should have said, oh, hold on, brother. Do not disrespect the dead. And please, out of anybody, don't even disrespect the man that we all seen murdered on video. That's all I got to say. I'm out.